Smart buildings are already producing a lot of renewable energy, much more than can be consumed right away. So instead of buying an expensive battery storage, why not just use your electric vehicles for this? Do you want to know how our VSEC controllers make your charging station ready for the smart future? Then stay tuned! My name is Rebecca Jentsch and I'm the product manager for our VSEC controller. Good news! With the right charging station, it's already possible to use your electric vehicles as intermediate energy storage with bidirectional power transfer that is based on the ISO 15111-20. Our charging station controllers have just been upgraded to the newest standard. So this enables your vehicles to feed back energy to the grid. As Vector actively participates in the standardization, we are one of the first companies to have the ISO 15118-20 bidirectional power transfer ready for you to test. So what is new with this upgrade of the communication standard? The ISO 15118-20 offers the possibility to perform bidirectional power transfer. So the EV drivers can charge their car, but they can also discharge it. And the thrifty among you can even earn money when they charge their car when the energy prices are low and then discharge them when the energy prices are high. The stored energy can also be used to perform peak shaving and therefore save money, for example when there is a sudden high power requirement resulting from machinery or when there are instabilities in the grid. This relates to the so-called grid serving charging. In the previous version of the standard, the ISO 15118-2, the electric vehicle controlled the power profile. So that means that the vehicle can take a charging break at any time. With bidirection power transfer, this leads to a conflict when you, as the charging station owner, want to perform peak shaving and therefore discharge the car. So with the ISO 15118-20, now the charging station controls the power profile. So the energy transfer parameters can be changed dynamically during a charging process. And this is called dynamic control mode. Therefore, the charging station can define an interruption of the charging process at any time. The introduction of bidirection power transfer brings sustainable energy usage to a whole new level. But what happens to the charging stations that are already installed in the field? Don't worry. With our VSEC controllers, the charging station can be upgraded remotely, so you only have to perform a software update. There are no hardware changes in our controller required. Make the most of EV charging and offer bidirectional power transfer in your charging stations now. But enough talking, let's take a look at our implementation in our next video. Let's get in touch to talk about your next generation smart charging stations. You can find our contact details below. If you like videos like this, please leave us a like and subscribe to our channel.